Okay, so the next stage that we need to do is the grip. So for the grip, you need pages uh, five and eight. So page five has the main part of the grip and page eight um, has the detail. So we'll just grab those. So first of all, page five. Again, try and push out carefully um, from the printed side to the non-printed side so you get uh, no danger of any tearing. So that's the main grip. And then we find page eight, which has the, uh, the two pieces of detail that go onto the grip. So again, we'll carefully remove those from the die cuts. Okay. Now, as before, uh, we can use our little headphone jack trick uh, to remove the small pieces of of, uh, of card from the screw holes. You can just pop all those out. There should be four on the grip. Okay. There we go. Those are all out. So with the grip, the important thing is to really fold it into the shape um, that you need in order to again. You know, reduce the pressure on the glue, and just to make sure that the you know the paper is in the right uh, is in the right form. So you have all the score lines. You can see those on the unprinted side. So just make sure that you fold everything into the uh, into the shape of the grip. And you can see that on the on the instruction page as well. Okay, so there's a few different ways of doing it. I normally cut a couple of little corners off here just to help me get everything in. So just cut those two pieces off the bottom corner. And then we want to uh, fold, basically kind of fold the, would be I guess the, the left hand side in on itself. So a little bit of glue on there, on that one tab, that's the only piece of glue you need. So hold that in place and then line up those two holes there. So line up those two holes at the top so that you make sure you glue it in the right place. Um, so that, uh, yeah, you can get the screw in later. So just hold it at the bottom, um, hold that Hold the two holes aligned so you're in the right place, so you know that that will fit onto the uh, onto the base model later. So the next thing we want to do is a little bit of glue on the bottom. So just apply a little, little bit of super glue on the bottom, fold that tab in, and fold the back of the grip uh, back on itself. So effectively you've got kind of uh, three sides of the grip now kind of in place. And you've got one screw hole lined up. Um, and as I said, the sort of three sides of the grip done and ready to uh, ready to put onto the onto the. Okay, so if you want to, you can pop the screw through there first, so those two of you know are aligned. And get that screw and line it up, and don't completely tighten it. Just uh, just make sure the screw is in place. And then you can fold it around and do the other sides so again, kind of as you did the first side. Um, line up those two holes and just put the screw in. Again, just to hold that in place. And that grip is there. And then you can basically do the last two pieces of gluing um, while the grip's in place. So just at the kind of bottom of the will be the right hand side of the grip, just glue that down and then while you're doing that you can also then glue right along the edge of this bottom flap and fold that over um, to keep the, the bottom of the grip also um, in place. So that's basically basically it for the main parts of the grip just keep a hold of those those two parts for a few more seconds while that dries. Okay, so you should have basically three or four glue marks now on the grip all dried, and then you can add the uh, add the side details. Just make sure you've got the right part. Um, so the little semicircle should go under the screw. So just apply some glue to that. Pop that on the side of the grip. Then that should actually hold in a couple of seconds. There's not too much pressure on that. 
I'll flip the base over. Just apply some glue and stick that around on the other side as well. So basically that's it. Um, just screw those screws in that you kind of loosely loosely put in before on both sides. And now you have your grip attached to the base. Okay, now we can move on to the side panel.